Alright, well. Now we get a scope Go along of the with place. them for now. That doesn't sound good. God damn it. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. David, you threw us in a cell. Don't expect us to smile about it. We do that to protect our people. It's not personal. You sure about that? You let me out. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. This is going to get awkward, Listen, isn't it? Listen, Gabe. He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. I don't know what Gabe's been telling you. <laughs> I didn't actually. I read that wrong. <laughs> He's been through a lot. Sometimes he blurs reality and fiction. I doubt he'd blur his sister's death. He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. By your people. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... How did she die? Your people. Tell me how it happened. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Uh-oh. Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. One of yours? Badger. What the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor. Keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Hmm. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here. But it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. So we got four. Oh god, she's back. It's fresh meat. Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Uh, baseball's long gone. Just regular old survivor brother now. <laughs> From what I hear, there's nothing regular about you. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. So she knows Clem. But of course, Javi doesn't know that. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said... You went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for we a while. We waited for you. For three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? 
Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Got oh, bitey. Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Oh, this, there's so going to be jealousy. We took care of each other. We all had each other's backs. Oh, you know how this is going to turn out. Took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. There's going to be some jealousy, and then there's going to be brothers fighting. Uh, we know how this is going. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. Whoa, We're man. Get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. I was gonna say the same about you. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? This seems like how... Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. This is, isn't this how the Walking Dead series started? Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you alone. She faked. Nice. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? Let's just get you better, Kate. And the facilities here. I don't care about facilities. We did fine without them before. You didn't have a ruptured spleen before. These people nearly killed me, Javi. David's people. Have you forgotten, Mari? Of course not. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. No, he is not a cage. gonna let that happen. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just, please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Ah, oh, shit. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. What are you trying to say? I'm worried about her. That's all. Nothing to get worked up about. It's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. Here we go. The jealousy starts. I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Well, that's one out. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can vouch for the rest of them too, right? It doesn't work that way. But we'll make the case for them soon. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're going to take real good care of you. Okay? This is Send a my bad situation. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. 
remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys, and I will handle him. Hmm. We'll have to figure out how to handle that. Might be best, because I don't know how much we want to stir the pot. Basically, we kind of need to get David out of the way, and if we don't publicly stir shit up, maybe they'll take care of him for us, but of course that gets us into trouble. Oh, there's a whole basket being weaved here. Woven. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. That you Pleased burn. to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> no complaints here. I get that you guys have a way of doing things. Thank you. We have Sucking to be careful. Sucking up like crazy right now. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden or a baked delicacy oh, come on. by yours? <laughs> Everything looks so good. I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please... Forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here. Wait. So, yeah. So People which who one's choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. I always do what I'm told. I ask my older brother. You're gonna fit in well, Javi. I can see that already. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty <laughs> fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Wait, so Please people understand. typically we don't escape. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We, we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer. It's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Uh-oh. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. I don't have a problem with him. He's all right by me. Yeah. Same here. I don't buy it. Max, how did this start? It's on him now. Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. Oh, 
We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. We I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? Girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. Clementine's not a bad person, at least from what I've seen. Of course you'd say that. You got that honor among thieves. Good. This is who Tense. you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. You think I'm bad? You have maniacs running around out there who are much, much worse. I'm not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Avi? You have something to say? You know what? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece. David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They overran Prescott with walkers, ran them in on trucks. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. Shit. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Well, that gets us all out. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here, your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. I can't leave Kate and Gabe alone. They won't be alone. I'll be here to take care of them. I can't help you now, but maybe I can down the road. Oh wait, I thought he was coming with Just us. stay alive. Okay? Now we've stirred the pot, this could possibly benefit us.